what is ADHD, symptoms, treatment, and more. ADHD's cause is unknown, but it is thought to involve a combination of biological, social, and psychological factors. Certain neural circuits associated with attention, inhibition control, motivation, and emotion regulation are related to ADHD. These brain differences are more common in people with ADHD than those without it. ADHD has a genetic component and tends to run in some families. The specific genes linked with ADHD are unidentified, but many may be involved due to the condition's complexity. These genes are likely related to certain neurotransmitters, such as dopamine. Exposure to toxins and chemicals like lead may contribute to ADHD. While a connection between lead exposure and ADHD is established, it doesn't guarantee a child will develop ADHD. The links between other toxins like bisphenol A and phthalates and ADHD are still unproven. Alcohol or tobacco use during pregnancy has been associated with ADHD symptoms in children. Nevertheless, the recent research questions whether substance use directly causes ADHD. Despite this, pregnant people should avoid alcohol and smoking due to other well-known risks. Traumatic brain injury, TBI, in early childhood has been linked to ADHD development. TBI is common, with nearly 3 million Americans seeking emergency treatment for it each year. ADHD is the most common psychiatric disorder associated with TBI. Premature birth or low birth weight may increase the risk of developing ADHD. Research confirms this, showing a stronger association with ADHD when birth weight is extremely low or birth is extremely preterm. Excessive dietary sugar or food additives and screen time have been associated with ADHD. However, they have not been proven to cause ADHD, although they may affect or exacerbate symptoms.